Hey everybody, uh, this is Chatty Daddy One coming at you. I uh, come across this video on YouTube here, and it is just amazing. I uh, everyone has been given permission to mirror this and send it out to anyone you can. This is some super classified information, and it explains the situation what happened at Fukushima with the uh, nuclear reactors and a bunch of stuff that's going on with nuclear power and a lot of secrets and stuff um, I'm sorry I can't I don't know how to give you the sound but this guy here um, died of cancer I'm sure that he was poisoned probably the same way they poison everybody that uh, gets out of line you know how Russia poisoned the guy a few years back but um and uh, the words here in the beginning are a little bit low but it'll it'll get better after a, just a bit but this is just some just amazing information and this guy he friggin knows what he's talking about um, but y'all, we're not being told the truth. We are in the black dark here, groping for the wall. Um, and there's some major things going on without our knowledge. But um, read what this guy says. It's <laughs> it's very interesting and a bit scary. And I apologize again for not being able to give you any sound. It's this guy speaking in, uh, I believe he's talking in Russian language. And he said that in uh, 2007 they stopped, Putin stopped um, producing uranium. Majorly caused a problem around the world. Because Russia supplied 70% of everybody's uranium. And Europe hadn't prepared for it. And they needed to fill the gap in production. Um, Areva announced they'd had excess uranium in some of the facilities they'd taken down. But this uh, uranium contained some 6% of lethal plutonium. Which is uh, not good. First year everything was fine. And I guess the Japanese bought up a bunch of this stuff and was using it for uh, power. Um, this also talks about HARP a bit too, but this guy's just telling some information that's just unbelievable. It's uh, it's amazing the things that we don't know. If you uh, you know have pains that you don't know where they come from, or headaches that you don't know why you get them, stress stuff like that. <laughs> You could probably bet it's this crap going on here. They, they're the powers that be are, are poisoning us all. Everybody's got cancer nowadays. You hear of cancer everywhere. I don't care who you are. You've got a neighbor or a family member who's got cancer or who has died from cancer. But that's just, this is amazing. I said they used harp to uh, try to fix this problem and it grounded it out. It was like a nail between the rock foundation there in, and the quartz crystals in the ground started vibrating. And everybody knows that you can take two big pieces of quartz crystals and rub them together in the dark and they'll throw off light. 
And this could have been what what we've seen is the light flashes out in the ocean, possibly. I don't know about y'all, but this guy sounds like... I mean, I know a little bit about some of this stuff, and it sounds to me like he's right on the money. I mean, it sounds like the truth to me. And, you know, this guy's dying. You can see that he's got cancer and he's he's withering away. Um, you can see just by the way he talks and the speed that he talks. He's not rehearsed. Um, it's coming from pure first-hand knowledge. I mean, he talks about it as it, you know, like it's his job, which I'm sure it was. But, uh, anyway, that thing exploded, caused the uh, tectonics plates to shift, and then there's, he's talking about there's a methane layer underneath the rocks that's two kilometers deep all around the world and guys th he's talking about there were several reactors that they took offline and shut down and to my knowledge is what and, and several of them um, <laughs> had problems I mean, they're putting the stuff out in the air, and they're using harp to try to scrub the air clean with rain. I mean, it's just insane. What are they doing to us? There isn't a whole lot of people that know. And the people that know that are talking about it, like this guy here, take a dirt nap real soon after they speak. And the guy that videotaped that you saw, they friggin' shot him, killed him. You know, thank goodness somebody got this tape out or they'd put it out on the web or something. But, um, everybody has permission to resend this, uh, mirror it, download it, get it out to everybody you know. This is um, important information that isn't common knowledge. I mean, the stuff this guy's talking about is just... It's quantum physics type stuff that is just wow. <laughs> That's all I got to say about it is wow. And that uh, we've been on a snipe hunt here in America and around the world. We're worried about, you know, somebody that's, you know, somebody's supposed to have come kidnap somebody's baby during the night, or we're worried about American Idol and crap like this, and, you know, stuff like this is going on behind our back. I mean, our tax money is being used for this. I mean, this guy's pretty much basically saying... He says that Katrina was a freaking storm created by Russia and China. And that we deflected it off. And all of, all of you YouTubers seen, you know, that hurricane that was headed for Florida get knocked back out towards the sea. You know, I mean, and this guy here backs that up. But it's just unbelievable, the stuff that this guy's saying, and, you know? And I mean, <laughs> he realized how bad this stuff was for the world and for the earth and for all of us. And, you know, that's why they fired him. That's why they radiated him so bad and, and, and killed him. Slow death. We all seen it with that. Like I said, with the guy in uh, 
Great Britain or wherever England that was running from the Russians and they, they killed him. He was a spy or something like that. Yeah, it's a radio transmitter. And he's basically saying, you know, asking him what is harp. <clears throat> and uh, that's another thing, Alaska, where a huge gas field is. Requires a lot of energy. They are monstrous transmitters. I've seen pictures of them. And they first started building them in Russia. The pure war machine. <laughs> One that they don't need to be messing with. They're going to end up screwing up the earth so bad. The next solar ray, solar flare that comes our way, it's going to just annihilate us because they're going to screw it up so bad. You know, we might be better off being hit with a doggone asteroid or comet or whatever. Whatever happens, I mean, it's, a, it's probably better than slow death, dying of cancer, and extreme pain. I know that my health is not what it should be. And, uh... There's no reason for it that I know of. I think about my dad and his generation. Well, they didn't go through all this kind of crap, just physical problems. Yep, can you create earthquakes with harp? Yep. That's what happened in Fukushima. U.S. attacked Japan because Japan didn't. Wow. The harp was used to turn down the risen ionization levels. And it's just about done here, y'all. But this is just this information. It's imperative that everyone that sees this, please, please, Get it out. Send it to as many people as you know. Re-record it. Send this version. You know, send any... All of this stuff. To anybody you know. I mean, we've got to get the word out. This, this cannot go on, people. And, um... Anyways, hope y'all are doing well, and uh, God bless, and take care. Good luck to us all. This is Chatty Daddy One, over and out. Y'all take it easy. See you later.